Hey guys, it's Rainy. Welcome to this happy, positive, grateful, well art home decor. For this, I'm going to be using three of these wood rectangles. I bought them at Hobby Lobby, I think it was, but I'm just going to be using three. Then I'm going to be painting them with this wet acrylic paint and this brush. I'm just going to be covering the front part of it. I'm not going to be worrying about the back part. I'm just going to mark the shape of the rectangle in a piece of paper. Then I'm going to handwrite happy, positive and grateful. I'm handwriting this, even though I don't have like the prettiest handwriting of all time, but I'm okay with that. If you prefer, just use a stencil with the like writing that you want. And then I'm going to cut those rectangles. Once I have done that, I'm just going to be placing the uh, piece of paper on top of my painted rectangles. I'm just going to pretty much rewrite the word in there with my Sharpie. And I'm doing this like this because you get like the mark of it. Once I remove that, it doesn't look as clear, but uh, this is just a guide. So I'm going to go with my Sharpie again, uh, basing myself from what I see there and just, you know, writing the whole thing. Again, as I mentioned before, you can use a stencil with some like writing that you like, but yeah, I just wanted to go for this method because I don't know, I guess sometimes I just don't want to buy stuff for one DIY that I know that I won't be using ever again. Uh, but you know, feel free to work with the method that uh, works best for you. I'm going to be using a rope and my hot glue gun and I'm just going to be working on the back of them. And as you can see, I was practicing my writing in the back to see how uh, much space I was going to use. This was before I made the template and all that. And I'm going to glue that, leaving a space of like one finger in between each uh, rectangle. And I used a ruler as well to just guide myself so everything looked as straight as possible. Once I reach the top, I'm just going to leave a piece of like rope to hang it. And then I'm going back the same way with my hot glue gun and my ruler. Then at the end, I'm just going to be making um, like knots on the bottom of those uh, pieces of rope that are just hanging there. I wanted to make this as a reminder for myself and share with you just in case you're like in the same page and that I should be more grateful for the things that I have and just count my blessings really instead of like focusing on what's missing or just wondering where it is I became really ungrateful for the things that I do have I turned like negative and bitter kind of I just end up being really unhappy I end up sometimes uh, comparing myself to other people and that's not like really healthy like mentally I don't think and just like everybody else I have dreams goals and I'm kind of like ambitious and sometimes I just get frustrated when I don't get things right away, I guess. And I wanted to have like this reminder because this life is a journey after all. But yeah, I just wanted to share this with you. Hopefully you like it. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Check out more home decor that I have on my channel. Let me know what you think of this one and subscribe for more. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye!